Hi, I'm Natalia Nunn, and we're doing a series on stars making it in Hollywood. I'm joined with Julia Waters, a model, and actress Liz Darby, and getting the inside scoop. I'm so frustrated with his manager. He won't even return my calls. I don't know what to do. Total crap. It is total crap. If I were somebody, he would return my calls. Here you go. I'm going to run to the restroom. to disturb you. My name is Sarah. I'm from Ireland. I'm in town for a couple of days for my sister's uh, wedding. Is your friend an actress? Oh, my friend. Yeah, she is an actress. You know what? I'm such a fan. Do you think it's possible if I got a picture with her? Do you think she would mind? I don't see why not. Are you ready? Uh, Liz, this is Sarah. She's from Ireland and has seen your work and wants to take a picture with you. <laughs> You've seen my work? Everything. In Ireland? Everything in Ireland. <laughs> Shut up. Okay, I'll get together. Come on. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh my gosh. You... <laughs> oh my god. I cannot wait to tell my friends I met Pura Farmiga. <laughs> Who is Pura Farmiga? I don't know. I'm correct. Did you take care of that? Yes. Come on, let's go. You look just like her. Oh my god! It's hard for anyone in this town making it, but a woman of your age, you don't feel that you're kind of a little too old to cut the mustard? Well, actually, Natalie, uh, it's I. Natalia. <sighs> Natalia. My. I have a certain joie de vie. Okay. Uh, are you sure this is gonna work? Are you kidding? This is perfect. This is our ticket to every red carpet event in the city. Which dress should I wear? Um. Oh, we'll wear the white one. It looks more like the one in the picture. Here. Oh, thanks. Mm. Mm. Okay, so if you're gonna be Vera, who am I supposed to be? My publicist. What? No, I wanna be an A-lister. Come on. I don't know, pick somebody. Well, what about Katie Holmes? Yeah, perfect. <laughs> Are you sure this is gonna work? Yeah. <gasps> oh yeah. We had become regulars on the red carpet. Ah, so I hear. But sources tell me that the only way you can get on a red carpet these days is by impersonating celebrities, Liz. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, you know, Nana. Actually, I think I have some footage here. Together. Come on. We just walked down that red carpet and these people, they want to meet you and they're going to put you in their films. Our, your career is about to, to blow up right now. It's going to be great. They want to have you in their films. They're going to love you. This is going to be so much fun, Julia. You're going to love it. I can't do it. Amiga. Vera for me. Excuse me. I'm sorry. 
How does this work? Will you see that lady there? You give her your name and what you do, and then she announces you. She runs the red carpet. Okay. Um, and then what do you do? Oh, then you walk, you stop, you pose, and then you walk. Name? Uh, Vera Farmiga. And how do you spell that? V E R A F A R R A R E I G A. Honey, it's your name, not a spelling bee. I know, but I want to get it right. <laughs> how often do you spell your own name, right? I mean, it's kind of like your phone number. My publicist usually takes care of this one. Let me guess. You're an actor. Yes. Yes, I am. Oh, thank you. Honey, get on with it. Beautiful smile. Take you to the back of the gown, please. Over the shoulder. Thank you. One more. Hey. I know you. What's your name? Liz. Liz Darby. Uh, you must have me confused with someone else. Uh, I saw you crash the Oscar gifting suite. I think I have my story. You got nothing, bitch. Hey! Hey, get out of that! Hey, can I get a copy for my reel? someone get her out of here? Julia, get the plug!